Hey guys, Dave here. This is my video response and contest entry into Mikey's um, sub 30 plus sub contest. If you don't subscribe to Mike, check him out. I'll put his link in the box below. Good videos. I mean, just an everyday guy, which is what I consider myself to be. I'm not an expert in any of this stuff. I'm trying to learn as we go. But his contest requirement was that you're a sub, which I am and that you make a video on your everyday carry setup. So without further ado, let's do it. Alright, so every day, let's go with this route. I have two setups. Here's my main one. Because uh, I can't really just carry whatever I want to the office. So, But every day I will have my wallet, which is a Maxpedition. That's a Spartan. Every day I have my iPhone. Mostly every day I have the work phone, um, keys, which I got to do something better with the keys, this big old key ring here, uh, but when I get to work, usually, you know, the carabiner, I'll take the set just for work, and then there's home, and car, and all that crap, so that's that. Now, Monday through Friday, weapon-wise, primary blade is going to be this San Remu. I think this is the 710. I won this from another guy's contest. He just had a 60 sub contest one day and just put all 60 subs in a hat and pulled a name and I won it and this is what it was. And I'll tell you what, for what I understand about these knives as far as price point, you cannot beat it. Um, thing is tremendously sharp. Um, a minor adjustment on the screw and you know it deploys pretty quick. Um, and I understand they're pretty reasonably priced, so that's my main blade. Also going to carry, this always in my back pocket, Victorinox. I don't know what model it is, it doesn't really say. But it's basically got scissors. It doesn't have scissors, no I'm sorry, two blades, bottle opener, can opener, screwdriver, corkscrew, all. Uh, toothpick and a uh, tweezer. And then every day I carry my Maritac AAA flashlight. This thing I bought, I guess I got it in like February. It's great. It's AAA, really bright, three modes, low, medium, high. And uh, I mean, I throw it in my back pocket every day with the Victorinox, and that's it. All right, so now. Um, on the weekends or on days when I don't have to run to the office when I'm wearing jeans and I'm more casual uh, It's gonna change a little bit Okay for one Well that stuff all there is gonna pretty much remain the same But my options for blades will usually change a bit um, It's gonna go with the uh, usually a tenacious or I've been carrying this lately Rat one bought these both from the cutlery shop this and the tenacious great blade deploys pretty quick. It's still a little stiff I think both of them were under 30 bucks. Uh, cutlery shop I was completely happy with. Recently my nephew ordered some things from them and a little disappointed in the shipping. Took forever, uh, which wasn't the big deal because it wasn't the main beef. Uh, they had a CRKT uh, on back order. Main complaint was a couple emails went unanswered. It took like three phone calls to get somebody to answer. But anyways, so um, that would we I carry weekends after hours days I'm not in the office and then that will also usually include this which is my C-Camp 32 uh, in a DeSantis I don't know what model this is this is just a pocket holster um, slips in your front pocket breaks up the print of the pistol and as you would pull this from your pocket this hook would grab the end and being able to deploy the, the firearm pretty easily um, had this gun, geez, for this pistol, I'd say for 10 or 15 years. Uh, it's pretty nice. Um, no sights. It's strictly point and shoot, up close and personal kind of deal. You can see that. No sights whatsoever. Uh, made in Milford, Connecticut. Um, I don't know. thought about getting rid of it re re recently and going with something else. For one thing, it's chambered for a specific round. Um, Winchester 40 grain hollow point silver tip hollow points and you know it's expensive and if you want to get proficient you really should practice and I don't get to practice as much um, as that. 
So that is my EDC setups. Mike, again, congratulations on the subs. Great job. Keep it up. Good luck to everybody in the contest.